In this short tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to set up your Google Classroom accounts uh, for students. First key step you need to have is a teacher account. You do need to have a teacher account through Scratch. That uh, step is not covered in this video. However, once you have your teacher account from Scratch, you simply go to My Classes, and there's a couple ways to get there. And then once you have uh, this screen up, you just click on New Class. Once you click on New Class, you give the class a name. Feel free to give it a description as well. Then click on the Add Class. Once you do that, you can add a, uh, images and graphics here. You can even use GIFs, which kind of add um, to, to the uh, background image and just make it look cooler. So I like to use GIFs there, or GIFs, sorry, GIFs there. And then um, you now have a class, but the students have to be able to get to the class. So what you have to do is you have to click on this little student tab, and you can add your students by making the accounts yourself. But what I like to do is use this student sign-up link. It will generate a sign-up link so they can automatically create a Scratch account and be in your classroom. However, they cannot transfer previously created accounts into your classroom. Just kind of a caution. A lot of students might have a Scratch account from other things. Um, you can't um, do that so you I ask my students to create a new account just for this class this link is a beast so what I do is I like to take that link and I like to go to a link shortener I like gg.gg so I'm gonna go to gg.gg I'm gonna put in that monster link and I'm gonna customize it and shorten it to um, for use um, in the class, so I'm going to make mine the Marquette PD for ECS. I shorten the uh, link. Fortunately, that link is available to me. I now have that shortened link, and I can then share that link with the students so they can go to that link to um, join the class. Now, that link is the link they'll use um, to sign up for the course. When students go to your link, this is what they'll now see. They'll see a sign-up uh, site that will direct them through how to sign up for the page. They'll just get started, and they'll create their own um, username and password, and then it will automatically be linked to your account. I like to just throw it on a slide and leave that slide up and then ask them to all register and get um, help from others if they need it. 